Hey guys, Joe Kulas here once again for K-Tactical. So today we're going to take a little bit of a look at uh, Ergo Rail Covers. Now, this is uh, my Class 3 SBR, which has an awesome Daniel Defense uh, rail system on it. Now, rail covers aren't necessarily meant for something like this. Uh, and what I mean by that is like the, you know, the edges are nice uh, and smooth. They're not super sharp, they're not going to really cut you. Uh, the gun itself has a pretty good, you know, just kind of grip to it and how it feels. But rail covers, again, can be used for a wide variety of things, whether uh, maybe it's a little bit on the sharper side and you just want to, you know, make it smoother, or if you want something that's a little bit grippier so it's easier to kind of get, get that hold on. Now, as you're going to see, uh, I actually had a full-length rail here, and then obviously I'd put a little uh, Daniel Defense uh, s swivel here, and I ended up cutting that off. Now the cool thing about uh, Ergo is they actually offer a lot of different pre-cut, pre-finished kind of rail covers. And that's kind of what, I got a couple of them here too. Uh, these are 8T markings and then 3. Now the kind of the perk to the, how this whole thing kind of goes a little bit is compared to, let's say I want to buy, uh, and again you don't know how exactly you want everything to be set up. Maybe you're getting new into guns, maybe you're getting new to that gun, but you still want the rail covers. Instead of buying the long rails and cutting them to fit, because, oh, maybe I want this halfway up or whatever, and then you're going to have to recut them, they're going to look a little bit more uh, ghetto. You can buy a ton of these three, for example, or you can buy some eights and threes, and as well, these are different colors. Just take a note to that. <clears throat> I got them through a contest thing, so I actually got these ones for free. I had the full length ones already. But uh, actually kind of interesting enough to where if I wanted these on here, which again, me personally, I don't need them on here. But uh, this 3-1 fits perfectly fine where that already is. And then the 8, I actually could cut uh, probably just the last one off. But I'm going to keep it on there just because, you know, I'm not, again, not going to be using it. And then as well if I wanted to add more to this side. But so it obviously gives you that kind of grippiness that you want and or possibly need. So kind of a quick look at it and as well uh, gonna get a closer look on it but you can see that it's pretty low profile it does not add uh, much length to it at all so kinda neat <clears throat> how that works now let's take a little bit of a closer look as well as you're gonna see it just you know it's pretty standard and pretty pretty straightforward for how it works so it just it actually uses all of the little notches to its advantage and it just kind of sinks in with it so I mean the product is developed great there isn't really a and I will say again you know I, I used these in the beginning for a while and I just kind of decided not to go with them if anything I use my surefire ones now so but again uh, for the money they're they're great they're very low profile and some people will buy it just, uh, again, you know, this is Dura-coated, uh, but if some people will buy it because, let's say, they're doing a, you know, a two-tone pattern something, and they're buying furniture that's already a certain color, and maybe they buy a rail that is, you know, one color, maybe they kind of want to make it look more interesting for the pattern-wise, I will say that, you know, using different colors to make the pattern more interesting or blend in, uh, that's a definite big perk to kind of that. But uh, again, besides that, uh, rail covers, I think for some people are needed. For me, personally, it's not 100%. I think that they have some perks, though. Uh, one thing I will say, though, is that, if any, Ergo does make a very good one. So keep that in mind if you're looking. Uh, as well, you know, there are other manufacturers of these that are good. Uh, probably Surefire is the second best, and the only reason I'm going to say that, Surefire has like a grip in to them. So, and they're much more grippy and durable. So, anyways, if anyone's looking at rail covers, uh, I would kind of suggest Ergo, to be honest, because they're, they're not bad. They are pretty cool overall, and they're very, very low profile. Uh, Meg poles, are honestly, are a little too bulky for me, but again, those even work as well. So, hopefully this video helps you guys out, and... Uh, Again, I'm going to be doing a couple other rail cover reviews here. I know not the most interesting thing by any means, but uh, feel free to check those out as well if you are interested. 
besides that, thanks for watching and uh, have a good day.